I hope you're having an amazing day. My name is Colin and in this video I will give you a full introduction to the Digits mainframe. The Digits mainframe as it says is the mainframe where all of the Digits ecosystem products are connected. This is where the staking takes place. I am logged into a dummy account right now but basically on the dashboard once you have an active agent staked you get complete access and the data will populate the digits coins that you're going to yield if you stake a founding agent on a daily monthly quarterly and annual basis uh, the overview of your coins and the overview of your coins active in the ecosystem how your coins are distributed because the mainframe allows you to send your digits coins not only hold them on the mainframe but also send them to other products which I will show you in a second. So you basically have an overview here of uh, where your coins are actually distributed across the different uh, products. On the coin feed, you basically have an overview of your yield and where you send the tokens, the NFTs that you have, etc. And then there's a shortcut here to the redeemer, which I will show you in a second. In case you quickly need to navigate the ecosystem, there's a list here of the different products you click on them you go and uh, redirect to the actual product there is staking available here with two different pools one for the founding agents that yield digits coins and one for the digit agents to unlock access both stakings are required in order to get access to the mainframe and the utility uh, on the basis per nft there is a governance here, uh, upcoming the governance vote, active vote, finish vote. These are some samples that we did uh, just to test everything, but I can show you what it looks like. So there's a governance vote. There's a little bit of an instruction on what the governance vote is actually about. We, you can vote with your wallet, yes, no. You see when the voting ends, you can give uh, comments uh, and, and people can see how you voted. Uh, you can talk with other people, basically. Uh, when the governance is concluded as you can see it is locked and then uh, inside the digits club discord the bot will basically announce uh, the results of the governance vote uh, but in under upcoming you will see uh, that there's nothing available right now but there would be and the bot would announce it apart from your yield which you can obviously find on the dashboard and the staking the most important feature on the mainframe apart from staking and governance is the redeemer of course uh, you can redeem things. Ooh, this is the test net. You can basically transfer your digits coins around the digits ecosystem. Because the digits coins are virtual currency and not actually on the blockchain, this is a completely gasless system, which of course is amazing. You can send your digits coins to a different product, but you cannot send them back to the mainframe. Very important. So once you choose to participate in a pool on digits path, send your coins over, then it's extremely important to note that you cannot send them back from digits path to the mainframe. Do you want to utilize them on a different product? So do make sure you choose carefully. You have digits path, the digits marketplace for the pools and the subscription for the digits tracker. Once this has been activated, if you have a founding agent, the digits tracker is already activated, then everything is set up. What is important for the Digits Marketplace and the Digits Pad that the pools, uh, 24 hours before a pool goes live, the status will move from open to locked. This prevents pool manipulation in terms of Digits coins on the actual product. You will be notified by the bot when the lock is going to become active inside the Digits Club Discord, Digits Pad and Digits Marketplace section. So don't be too stressed about it just make sure you send your coins on time and pools are well announced ahead into the future two interesting features below here is you can create the nfts so you cannot transfer your digits coins from account to account because it's virtual currency uh, and we basically have web3 technology here so how this goes is you can wrap your digits coins inside an nft then you can sell this NFT on OpenSea. Somebody can buy this NFT, click on burn NFT, and basically upload the amount of digits coins that is active on the NFT. This is the way that you can transfer digits coins from one account to another. 
you have an overview of your transfer to the failed transactions, the dates, the timeframes, a complete log here. So if you ever need to look back where your coins are or how many coins you've spent, purchased, acquired, you can basically find that all in this overview. The digits mainframe, most importantly, is the core of the ecosystem. Uh, statistics, redeeming, governance, voting and staking. Uh, two different models as per usual. For the founding agents, stake your founding agent, get access to all of the products immediately, yield digits coins and then use or sell your digits coins as you please. The selling happens through the Redeemer NFT creation. Uh, you can also expand the utility of your founding agent on digits pet pools or digits marketplace where you still uh, are required to spend digits coins in the several opportunities available there. If you are a digit agent, you stake your agent and get access uh, to the tools that your digit agent get access to. You want to expand the utility up to a level of a founding agent or beyond. You can buy digits coins on OpenSea, which you're basically buying from the people yielding them on the left side. The company does not sell any digits coins ever. You can use digits coins on products. This is what it looks like. The Redeemer can create NFTs, can burn NFTs and brings you the utility to the four products by bridging this through OpenSea, bringing you a handful of different opportunities. The Digits mainframe, the core of the Digits ecosystem where everything starts and at the end, the coins are being yielded, consumed and you can get the maximum utility uh, from your NFT.